everything we once knew is gone. We've become drifters, roaming the wastelands, scouring the wreckage for something to hold on to, searching for someone to light the way forward. And welcome back to more Surviving the Aftermath. When we left off, we were um, basically trying to still get our specialists out in the world and grab supplies from the world map. Uh, as you can see, we've opened up a lot of the world map and uh, trying to gather these. Resources. But back home at the camp, uh, right now, we're currently doing a lot of upgrades. I just upgraded the um, fishing pier. I'm upgrading a few tents so to be basically crowded. So basically bunk beds so we can fit more people in there. And we've added a mating shop and we're going, to, we got a, a hunting cap in there which we're going, we currently started to upgrade. So, let's add some people there. gonna move the work area to try to cover as much of this area as we can so let's try to get that on the go because what we're gonna do is right now we have not enough food for the amount of people we're in our camp, so we really need to get these. That's why We've I upgraded the these uh, food resources to try to see if I can get more food incoming. Right now, we're going to only have one person uh, doing the maintenance. Um, as of right now, we don't need more than that. But I might add another person on to the hunting cabin to try to get more food. We have another area that is. So our wood is officially gone now, I think. I don't think there's any more. Well, there is one more up here. And yeah, there's some over here. And since this area has been opened up, we can go ahead and demolish that and get some resources back. But yeah, like I said, we're just going to continue on and continue to grind through to try to make this the uh, best camp that we can. Hopefully at some point we'll be able to actually turn this into a colony. So stick with me, stay tuned, and um, we're going to get through this together. So this is another area that's been upgraded. Oh, well, not upgraded. Scouted out so we can go ahead and demolish that and get some supplies back. And with that, I can actually, what is this concrete? I actually have enough that's been discovered so I can actually get another water source, another food source on the go. That might be the thing to do. I just got to get a road out there, which let's get some research going first. So we just unlocked Frontier Outpost. Um, so now kind of in a quandary of what I want to do. Do I want to go ahead and try to get down through here? Um, or do I want to try to, I have hand crafting. I, I need to get that research. So I can start crafting tools and um, coats and things like that for our colonists. So that's what I think I'm going to up. And then I'll mess around and I'll grab a, cube, a 
apprentice so we can open up another work slot for those areas. So that'll be coming up next. So for right now, I think that I want to get an outpost built. Where do I want to put it though? That is the question. I think this is going to be my um, work area. So I think I'm going to put that right here. Yeah, I'm gonna slap that down right there. Extend the road out. build a road out to here because I am going to get another water source and another uh, fishing pier on the go here. Yeah, I get it. Y'all want to leave. I could start to um, build some shanties, but that's going to take a, a lot of metal of which we don't have right now. there well I have two people in there so yeah why are we not what is the problem actually forgot to ask how are you lovely people doing today? I usually uh, do my opening intro with asking that I apologize um, but I kind of wanted to get a head start on this video and uh, we actually have a worker that seems to have died right here cause of death all day Okay, so we actually got the road built. So we're going to try to get it. Let's go ahead since we let's get another fishing gear up going. High efficiency at a hundred percent. Drop that down. Um, and uh, we're going to put up another uh, water collector. I know a lot of people said that they don't like them because. They're not as efficient as, say, water wells, but at this point, anything will, will help. But right now, I, I, no, I'm not going to drop that in. I'll wait. Uh, right now, more importantly, we need um, food. And we don't have a huge population right now. I mean, we have 42 people in the camp, but or is what pool of workers we have. We don't have a huge amount of people. Okay, we got a couple of scavengers out here that Mission have complete. scavenged. Do I want to send him? No, your, your health is already looking a little weak. Uh, might have to send you back. Um, go ahead good. and return. All cleaned up. You got resources. What is your health looking also looking a little going back to the camp Consider and get healed up. Okay, both of our fighters are at the camp, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to send both huh? of them. I don't really want to, but What's I'm going to actually send both of them out to the world map so they can start clearing some of these uh, weak and low area bandits out the way.
All right. Yeah, she's on the go. That's why I thought. Not gonna work. Yeah, we only have one science on the scientist on the map. Any, any rate though. Gonna send her down over here, or well, both of them actually to deal with these bandits in the immediate area, so we can just clear them out. Yes. Engaging hostile. Yes. Engaging hostile. That should be a pretty easy victory. So we'll just let that roll until they get there. And um, what I'm going to do is go ahead and speed up time a little bit so we can um, get some things done. Okay, There's so the a new quest to We've made a new discovery. So we need to move the area, the work area, for the berries and put that here. What did we find? And we have the tool shop and the tailor shop. Um, so how much flax do we have? We have 27, 20, well, 47 fiber. Um, so as of right now, I'm gonna go ahead and drop down another field. And that's going to be another fiber field. As soon as that's up and running, we'll go ahead and have them supply that with uh, flax. And as far as our people, we have seven children, so we have enough to fill up a school. So at some point, I'm going to get a school up and going. Get this going so we can get We've a made food a new source. discovery. Okay, that's done. Let's get another person, so it's in progress. It's about to be done. It's done. Let's go ahead and get some more flax. Now have a little, well, not a little, a small problem of where I want to build next. Um, so, what do I want to put down? Um, I need tools and I need a tailor shop up. So, oh, a magnetic storm. Crackling area with a faint smell of ooze. Devices begin shutting down and power plants seize up from one by one. Short circuiting components start electrical fires around the colony. Information, energy production shuts down. Building production, buildings producing or consuming energy might be damaged. Slight increase in radiation sickness cases. Build battery racks and charge them fully to keep the colony running through the storm. Unlock the building lightning rods to protect your energy producers and consumers. Okay, well, I don't think we have any buildings that take electricity right now. So, I think that's a saving grace for us. So, what I'm going to do is go ahead and drop down the tailor spot right here. So, at least we can have that going. We have another, um, we can recruit another specialist right now, but I'm not going to do that right now.
Also, I need to figure out if I'm going to um, I'm gonna get rid of this tent. I demolish it. And what I'm going to do with that is then build a shanty right here in this spot. was it? Yeah, okay. go ahead and take that back to the colony. Then uh, you can come back out. Your orders? They're both fighting, which it should be over fairly quickly. Here. In about two hours time. That's another milestone been reached. maximize the area which our maintenance personnel can cover. There are survivors at the gate. Interesting, really. Hope they have something good. A ragged bunch shuffles slowly towards the gate. Um really don't want to take any more people in uh, until we can get a lot more food supply going. They're coming with iodine pills, canned fruit, basic tools, and some fuel. No specialist is with them. We have six children, three adults, well, one adult and three elders. The only reason that I would take them is because they have six children that will eventually grow up to be adults, which for the future, that would probably be advantageous for us. So, um, I'm gonna go ahead and break my own rule and take them in this time, just because of I'm banking on the fact that, that they will, grow up to be adults three el the three elderly are not ideal but yeah so for right now I'll take it. we've reached a milestone now back to what I was doing um, we can't build the school until we get some uh, I believe Let's see or do we have everything School takes 75. We still don't have enough metal right now um, for school. When we get like 75, I'll go ahead and then try to build it. Clothing. Let's go ahead and put another person in. Another milestone has been reached. Badlands Oasis. Reach a population of 50. We got a nice little surplus of uh, workers and carriers. Um, we won the battle. Wood out of that? Okay. Not really what I wanted, but 
Attacking. Huh? Showtime. Let's see, who are you? Fighter. Yes. Just because I need, I want to have one in the camp at all times, just in case we have some raiders that show up and they want to do battle, or we have some type of infestation of bugs or something that want to attack the camp. It's always nice to have a fighter in the camp, if all it possible. Now, I do have an outpost depot. Um, that I can use to create a settler um, camp out here in the world. And I want to get like a flow of steady research coming in. So I need to find one but I don't think we have one open to us yet. Oh uh, yeah, it's down here. And one right here, there's two back to back. So I think at this point, I'm going to train Nadia, even though she's a scavenger, to um, be the one to come out here and put an outpost up down. So I think that's what I'm going to do. So, Nadia, you're the lucky person. Uh huh. And I'm gonna send you down here. Okay. And as soon as she gets there, we'll go ahead and set up an outpost. Dead rats are considered to be more of a nuisance than an actor. I've already... Why is this popping up? I've already built roads. Okay. I think right now... Let's see who... When you get some more action points, Going. come on down here and do that one. Wow. There's a lot. Well, as soon as my um, fighters get done taking out this, we'll go ahead and send them over here to start the quest over here. But in the meantime, let's go back. The lumber yard is out of wood. Then we need to move the work area. Um, let's see here. Let's go over here. And I need to build. I think I have enough now to build that. Yes, I do. So we're going to build this brawl pit just to give some these people something to do. I'm going to drop this down right here. We're going to go ahead and build that next. And um, the only other thing that I want to build is... forest that grows sapling trees so where do I want to put this? put this here and research is ready so let's see what we can do bartering Concrete, concrete sledgehammer, production speed is an increase. 
we got the apprenticeship lock apprenticeship unlocked so that's cool how about in food community eating would be great but I, we don't have the necessary pipes ran or we haven't even researched that at all um, reinforced gates Secure, there's flushing for the toilets, leadership. I really do want this leadership building at some point. Um, the colony center, basically. Um, should I invest in this right now? Or is there something better I can invest? Mm, I think it might have to be, yeah, I think it really might have to be um, water piping. Let's get that on the go. And that is done, and we have an instant boost to happiness because of it. Great. We'll have colonists that have died, old age. So, as soon as this forester building gets put up, we'll go ahead and um, assign a work area for the forester buildings to uh, start planting sap um, seeds for sapling trees to be put down. Send you back out in the world. Ready. We're gonna send you back out in the world also. Okay. Your orders. Um, you're good to go, so we're gonna send you over here to get these. You, unfortunately, I'm going to send you to deal with hmm. Yeah, come over here and I'm going to need you to grab these coats. Right away. You are steady making your way down. Excellent. We're actually losing this. All right. Engaging hostile. Here we go. Hopefully they'll be able to engage here pretty soon. Yep. Sorry, can't do that. Yes. I'm gonna tell you to stop engaging. Can I tell you? How may I help? No. Hopefully this works out. I don't want to lose one of my fighters because I didn't have them set in the right spot. So 
So as I was asking earlier, you know, how was your day? How was your Sunday? Was it eventful? Was it just a chill day? Are you just, just decided, hey, you know what, it's Sunday. I'm not going to do anything at all. But regardless, We've made a new discovery. you decided to sit back and watch this video. And I want to thank y'all for that. And come hang out with me. So uh, this video will most likely go up a little bit later than I would normally have it up on a Sunday because I was out doing some things. But with that being said, the video will go up. Thank you. We're going to send you back to go get. Okay. And then we're going to leave you uh -huh. on the world map because you should be able to handle. No, you can't. Well, send Run. you back also because there's no real reason for you to be hanging out. Mission complete. Science has been gained. All right. We're gonna send you back over here. This should Sounds be no good. problem. What's up? You're still slowly making your way. All right. Could someone please pick her up and put her in the bed? So, now that we have water pipes unlocked, what should we now research? And this is where I can really use your help. As we start to get into advance from the early portion to the mid, the mid game, and even into the late game, um, for those who've played this game, um, let me know what I should be out on the lookout for, what I should be doing, what did you do, what worked for you. Um, so, you know, if you mind, go ahead and drop those down in the comments section below, and I'll be sure to read them and uh, try to implement some of the ideas and things that you did into my playthrough. Um, so. Direct heating, I don't know if I really need that. Um, large drums would be cool. That would give us a larger clean water storage by volume, which could be very helpful. Um, don't think I want to do anything else in here. I already got this. Uh, botanical gardens, shrines, uh, remembrance. Mm, proper burial, public housing. This is all helpful with happiness and entertainment, but I don't think I want to do that. Well, what I think I really want to do is go ahead and get flushing or secure storing and then go get the reinforced gate because something's telling me that I'm going to need in the mid game. Bartering would be cool, but I don't think we have anything that is worth bartering at the moment. Line cook, communal eating could be great. That takes water. Uh, you know what? Let's go ahead and get that on the go. That's 250 research. So let's just figure that out. Now, what I wanted to do is try, see, this is a water tower, which, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and put this down here. And then I'm going to try to fit another one right next to this area here. This is good. 
A colonist has spotted a bottled message on a riverbank. There's a few more things that I want to try to get done before I um, end this video. Like, I want to get another shanty built. Um, we have enough for 58 people. We have a total population of 51. So, I'm good with that. But what I really want to do is get this school built. Um, I think I want to put it up here. Yeah, I think I'm going to put it up here. So what specialist is ready? Is it? Ready. No, you're ready. You're steady going there. Um, yep. Not going to happen. Yeah. Who, why did it say? All right. Oh. Yep. You're going back to base. Yes. You're steady working. Reporting in. Yeah. So, I don't see anyone that's ready. But anyway. We've made a new discovery. Community eating, what does that take? That takes, ah, oh, that's not that bad, but it takes water. Um, two water. So before we even start to even think about building it, um, line cooks adds a person, advanced farming, adds medium to large fields, um, which I think I might want to get, but I'm not sure I want to spend 350 right now. Large drums, might want to come back to that. I think I might grab that public housing, botanical gardens, shrines, um, remembrance, that's 200. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and roll with this. And go ahead and try to get flushing. Um, Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and. Okay, so that's being researched right now. So this holds a capacity of 500 clean water. I want to see some what is these this is also 500 interesting so what is the difference between this one and this one Food is still not where I want it. I mean, 
we need to get a lot more food together before we can really get any more people into the colony. So, need to figure out how I'm going to do that. School has been completed. Thank you. And now our children, occupants, are maxed out seven of seven. So finally we have a school on the go. And we're about to be done with researching secure storing. Any second now? We've made a new discovery. Okay. General storage. Okay. So I'm going to plop this down. Hopefully I can fit it right here. Let's look at the area. Do I have? Yeah. Okay. And after that, I think I'm, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get this instead of flush. I'll come back and get flushing, but I really want to get this before the end of this uh, video. We have someone at the gate. What's going on? A weathered woman carrying a worn out backpack marches toward the gate. Please, do you have any medicine? There. She asked. Her voice trembles. My baby is running a high fever and I'm desperate. I don't have a lot to offer. But I could trade you for something for it. So basically wheat and I don't know what type of grain. This looks like beans. Um, well, we're not going to turn her away. So what I am going to do is go ahead and Yeah. Mm. Okay. Our scientist is ready. All done. Uh. Yeah, I might have to send you down. I think okay. we could be able to get it. What's All up, cleaned bro? up. Cool. Currency found 129. 17 tools. Damage received was 20. Huh. Wasn't bad. Wasn't bad. Um. You won't do that. We'll. I won't do that to you, but I will have you pick up these iodine pills on the way back to the house. Yeah. Okay. All right. We're going to have you build a research outpost right here. Okay. Outpost is now complete. So now we have 80 science points that will be produced every 24 hours. Not bad, not bad. It looks like though we can put a couple of them down here. And looks like um, I should be able to um, put another outpost down here for the, um, the scavengers outpost. So, not a little bad location here. My scout is, okay, she scouted this out. More research, clothing. Okay. okay. We'll go over here. All right. You know what? I'm gonna have you. I'm gonna have you go here. Can't complete order. Um. 
take that right around, come around, and then start grabbing this stuff over here. And my scientist... Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna leave you like you are. That'll work. Okay, as soon as my fighters get healed back up, I'm gonna send y'all back out. You're already ready to go. You're taking your time. As soon as the gate gets researched, we'll go ahead and upgrade our gate. I said I was going to go ahead and as soon as this gets done, I'm going to go back and get this and then upgrade it. So they're producing 20 and we're consume our consumption is 22. So we need to figure out a way to find a way to upgrade this to just basically get another slot. So we might actually have to forego flushing for right this moment, come back and grab this. Uh, advanced scrapper so yeah I think we might have to do that just so we can get more metal going yeah because I don't need to do this we have more than enough plastic right now but this will probably be our yeah the best thing for us right now so soon as we get done with the gates we'll come back and grab this for 150 Well, we've come a long way. We've made huge strides. Um, we need to really start worrying about trying to figure out a way to get this pollution cleaned up on the map. Our scout is ready. Job He's job. done again. Why is this red? Negative. Okay. Well, okay. Oh, uh, it's already being researched. I mean, being scouted out. Ooh. Well, I'm gonna send you up here. Okay. But what we can do is go ahead and put another, uh, since we have a surplus of people right now, is get another um, scout building out. To where they can scout this area out a little bit more. We've made a new discovery. Yay. What's up? How may I help you? We have bandits at the gate. We gonna have food tonight. As soon as they get this carcass cleaned up. We'll go ahead and check out this quest at the gate. Alright. 
cleaned up. Okay, sir. What do y'all want? A large group of refugees have gathered outside the gate. They look extremely malnourished and their eyes sheen with quite despair, desperation. The bandits took us hostage. They sent us out here to gather resources. If we don't bring anything back, they'll kill our families. Please, one of them pleads. The group is large and is taking them down by force would be very hard. 20 medicine, huh? Ooh. Uh, I'm not giving you no money. Well, I could give you, but I don't know if I want to give you um, medicine instead. Either 20 medicine or 400 coins. Y'all know me by now, and I ain't trying to give up nothing. Uh, I know they're probably lying. But, you know, if our gate was up or had been upgraded, I probably would just battle it out. But I think I'll go ahead and give them four silver this time. A wave, of, a wave of relief washes over the group. Thank you. We didn't want to fight. This will help us for sure. The group takes the resources and hurries off to trade them for their family. And let's go ahead and upgrade this, yes. I'll be a lot more happier. And it just adds another person and some tough and some more toughness to the gate. Cool. Where do I want to? Yeah, I'll put that here. Because I really need to figure out where I'm going to put these large farms. Said I was going to double back and grab this, so I'm going to pick this up now. And that way we can go ahead and upgrade our outhouses. But we need to find another, we need to find, put down some more wells. Eighty percent. Yeah, let's put one down here. Our scout is done scouting. Mission what did complete. you find? More research. Go back to the camp. There's somebody at the gate. Um, we got what? What's going on now? Something unusual has been found in the forest surrounding the colony. A wagon is parked deep into the woods. The windows covered with tarp. There is a fingerprint around the vehicle, but they can't be tracked. Our footprint, footprints, 
around the vehicle, but they can't be tracked. There could be something valuable inside, but opening the wagon is not without risk. Let's go ahead and do that, and we get, well, we, it took us two, minus two tools. We got plus six, so we got four, and we got 20. So we're good. We, that was a good, that was a good choice. Okay, what do you have? What are you, a scout? Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna take this in because actually, what I'm going to do is take you and immediately train one of you, train you to go out. Uh huh. And I'm gonna send you down here. You go back out in the world map. Your you orders? Go back out in the world map. And I still, before I, we start tackling this main quest, I kind of want to clear up some of these bandits from around in this area. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, I know I said I was going to start the main quest or this quest line, but I want to clear out this sector um, first. So, yes, we're gonna come down here. There was no one closer, is it? No. We're gonna come down here. Attacking target. Yes. And Engaging do hostile. the same exact thing. Coin is kind of running a little bit low, but we'll be all right. As soon as flushing gets ready, our scout is done again. She, I'm all telling y'all, she is so quick. What is that? Electronic store, huh? Moving. So we'll be able to have flushing toilets. We so made a new discovery. Help. Upgrade. Okay. So as soon as they're upgraded. Okay, you're still scouting out the area. It's only 71% complete. Okay, I'll leave you be. Some more woods over here. Some more water up here. We could probably do with scouting at it, this area up here. Yeah, looks like there's something over. Looks like a little bit more cotton. Well, you know what? So that should be all of our wood stores for right now. Like I said, there's a small area up here, but I don't think that's worth our time. But what I am going to do is put up a scout stand so I can scout that area. What? what am I missing? Oh. There we go. That's going to have to wait to get built until we can get some more metal. But like I said, what I wanted to do is go ahead and 
Get another scout tower going over in this area. Plastic, metal. I don't know. If we get a surplus of people, we might actually have to get another um, metal um, recycling building up. But for right now, you're All done. Confirm. Going, Going back to the colony. Mission complete. Alright. We're going to send you back to the colony so you can heal up. Colonists are arguing over a rusty metal box which lays on the ground between them. They both claim ownership over the coins inside. The man find, for finding the box, the woman for getting the lock open. There's plenty of coins inside, enough considerable help the entire colony if needed. Um, let's see. I'm going to confiscate one third of the coins and split the rest evenly. There we go. As soon as this gets built, we'll have fresh running running water to the toilets and showers. And there it is. Clean, fresh, no contamination around the toilets. One less thing that we have to worry about contamin decontaminating. New vehicle found. All right. All right. So let's recap of what we've done. We made huge strides in this episode. We've gotten some new scout towers up. We've got a school up and running. We have a tailor shop up and running. We, we upgraded our hunting cabin. We've upgraded our piers. Did I upgrade this one? I can't remember if I did. No, I did not. Um, yeah, go ahead and upgrade that just so we can get more food coming in. So like I said, we've gotten the school up and running for our kids. We've got the tailor shop up and going. Uh, the hunting cabin has been upgraded to an actual hunting cabin. We've got general storage now. We've got uh, shanty, a uh, one. We've uh, put bunk beds in some of these tents. I mean, so for right now, we're kind of in a good spot. We got plenty of Expresses out in the um, world map, red gathering resources. We even got a couple of outposts up and functioning for right now. So, what is this? Okay, so that's done. That's our food storage. Um, is there anything else before I get out of here? For uh, yeah, there is right here. So all in all, we've got a population of 51. All in all, we're doing pretty good. Now what I might have to do is because I have so many people, I might actually have to put another outhouse here. There are survivors but we'll see. at the gate. We have more survivors at the gate, but we're not gonna take them, or are we? You'll have to tune in for the next video to see what I do. But until then, kind people, I want you to understand that I really sincerely hope that you have a blessed rest of your day. And for those who's going to have a rough work week, I just want you everything's going to be all right and just take it day by day. And the last thing I would just like to say is, once again, I'd like to thank you all for came, coming by and hanging out with me and watching the video. And if you really want to support me, go ahead and hit the like button. 
always welcome to comment down below and subscribe to the channel if you're new to try to help and support this channel grow. Until the next video, kind people, this is Man Cat, and I'll see y'all later. Have a good one, everyone. Nobody's safe. Soon as we step out the cage.